Welcome to the stream of knowledge. If you are diagnosed with high blood pressure and need medical treatment, you are at the right place. Today, we will discuss four medications for high blood pressure that your doctor considers first for you. Number 1. Angiotensin Converting Enzyme or ACE Inhibitor. This kind of medication plays an important role in relaxing blood vessels and blocking some hormones actions in order to control blood pressure. Now the important question is, who should not take ACE inhibitor? 1. Pregnant women. ACE can be harmful to babies during the last six months of pregnancy. Number 2. People with kidney diseases. As ACE could reduce the kidney blood supply, it is not safe for this type of person to use it. Number 3. People with a severe allergic reaction. If taking ACE causes any severe allergic reaction to your body, stop taking it and seek medical care immediately. Second common type of hypertension medication is diuretics. Diuretics facilitates urination to discharge excess salt and water to control blood pressure. Now the question is who should not take diuretics? Number 1. Older people, they tend to have a more severe reaction to dehydration, which indicates diuretics should be avoided. Number 2. Pregnant and breastfeeding women, diuretics may be passed from the mother's body to the baby, thereby contributing to the dehydration of the baby. Number 3. Kids, diuretics can cause calcium deficiency, leading to impaired bone development. If taking ACE causes any severe allergic reaction to your body, stop taking it and seek medical care immediately. Third type of hypertension medication is angiotensin II receptor blockers or ARBs. Angiotensin receptor blockers or ARBs are used to treat high blood pressure. They include herbisartan, balsartan, iosartan, and candesartan. Now the question is, who should not talk ARBs? Number 1. People with certain kidney problems. Number 2. People with low levels of sodium in the blood. Number 3. Pregnant and breastfeeding women. Fourth type of hypertension medication is calcium channel blockers. You may wonder how blood pressure control can be related to calcium. However, calcium can flow into muscle cells of the heart and arteries, making muscles contracting stronger and harder. Calcium channel blockers work by blocking calcium into your blood vessels, which relaxes muscle contractions to lower your blood pressure. Now the important question is, who should not take calcium channel blockers? Number 1. People with heart problems. Number 2. Pregnant and breastfeeding women and people with severe allergy. In our next videos, we will discuss 1. Risk factors for high blood pressure patients. 2. Exercises to control hypertension. 3. And first aid for hypertensive emergencies. Which of the above mentioned topics you would like to know first? Do comment in comment section. Thank you for watching. Do subscribe, like, comment, and share.